now that we've discussed building powerful momentum via the lighthouse turn, we're almost ready to add the vertical element of arm action in the golf swing. Before we do that, we've got to learn the importance of keeping the swing center steady as we wind up and unwind in the golf swing. Jack Nicholas says that keeping the head steady is the number one universal golf fundamental. And he's absolutely correct as his record shows. I'd like to refer to the top of the spine though instead of the head because the head can move, has quite a bit of uh, room to move in the golf swing, but the, the top of the spine has to stay in place. There are a number of ways to check the top of your spine to make sure that you're doing it properly, and the easiest one of those is to go outside late in the day and use your shadow as a feedback system. There are other ways, other things to check when you make your lighthouse turn. One of the easiest things to do is look in a mirror and notice, Michelle, would you do one for us right now? Notice when you make your lighthouse turn and you finish the swing, is your belly slightly closer to the target than your head? That's a good indication that you cleared your hips, the top of your spine stayed back, and the bottom of your spine maybe moved a little bit toward the target by the time the swing was finished, okay? If you're having trouble with, with this idea and you find your spine going this way and that, the first thing to check is that you've got too much tension in your upper body and you're using your shoulders to unwind and that force is pulling you off balance. If your triangle is relaxed, it's easy for it to turn in place. If you still have a problem, think about the idea of your shoulders turning right where they are. Okay, there's a top of your spine is almost the hub of your arc. Your shoulders turn right in place. Make sure that they're behind the ball position. We haven't talked about a ball yet, but the ball would be kind of in line with your left ear. So if you make the unwinding motion and your, your spine and your shoulders are still behind the ball, chances are your spine didn't move very much. The best time to build a steady swing center in your golf swing is when you're learning the lighthouse turn. Don't wait until you've built the full swing. Do it now, okay? And the best way to do that is to check yourself by using your shadow and a golf ball. Just place the golf ball, wait till late in the day, and place the golf ball at your swing center or your head of your shadow, okay, and monitor your shadow to make sure that your head's not moving as you wind up and unwind in the lighthouse turn. Michelle and I will demonstrate that for you now.